Getting out of debt is becoming harder for Hoosiers. That's according to a local bankruptcy attorney who says credit card debt is at an all-time high. As Rachel Wilkerson reports, it's also leading to more bankruptcy filings. It's been a real challenge. Julian Smith lives in his car, trying to get back on his feet after filing bankruptcy last month. It can seem hopeless at times, but once you're on the other side of it, things should look a bit better. His debt piled up due to a failed rental business based in Carmel. He started it after losing his restaurant job during the pandemic. Got laid off twice during that. Then the whole paradigm of how restaurants work shifted. Indianapolis bankruptcy attorney Mark Zuckerberg says his office is seeing a major increase in filings. He says many are mom and pop shops and trucking companies that tried to make it through COVID but ran out of COVID assistance funds. As the business fails, the people that they signed the guarantees are now coming after them individually. So I'm having to do a lot of bankruptcies for people whose businesses fail. It's a, it's a double whammy. Not only do they lose their business, but now they have to file bankruptcy themselves. Hoosiers are also struggling with credit card debt. Credit cards are at an all-time high. Nationally, it recently passed $1 trillion. That's on top of student loan repayment, mortgages, and inflation. The people were on deferments during COVID. According to the U.S. Bankruptcy Court for the Southern District of Indiana, personal bankruptcy filings are up nearly 20 percent compared to last year. Business filings are up as much as 40 percent. Bankruptcy is there to help people. Zuckerberg says what is typically a last-ditch effort for many can help. It may take literally 30 or 40 years to pay off the debt. And they're not saving any money in the meantime. If you use bankruptcy, you can get rid of the debt and start putting money back into your own savings accounts so you can actually get ahead. It's a constructive tool to, you know, get your finances back in order and hopefully rebuild your credit. So I, I still recommend it. It's just a rough road. Rachel Wilkerson, WRTV. Bankruptcy attorney Mark Zuckerberg says the two most common types of bankruptcy filings in Indiana are Chapter 7 and 13. Chapter 7 allows people to keep their assets without paying creditors back and it stays on your credit report for 10 years. Chapter 13 is for people who can't afford to pay debts in full but have a steady source of income and agree to a repayment plan over a three to five year period. Chapter 13 stays on your credit report for seven years.